Are you ready to take your coaching business to the next level this year with Kajabi? Well, today I'm taking you through a step-by-step -step tutorial showing you the ins and outs of what you need to know to build a successful either one-on-one -on -one or group coaching program with Kajabi. I'm going to take you through all of the things. Are you ready? Let's dive in. What's up, it's Danny. I have taken my YouTube community and built an over six figure business using the power of Kajabi. And if you wanna do the same and follow along with this tutorial, be sure you grab my extended 30 day trial link. And with that, you get immediate access to my zero to 10K course roadmap as a thank you to you that teaches you how to make your first $10,000 in course sales. All right, now let's get into this tutorial. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to go into products and hit coaching. You'll see here on your dashboard any upcoming coaching calls that you may have. You'll also be, see up here you have your programs. This is your different coaching programs and we'll talk about this in a second. You'll be able to see clients and then your overall settings as well. So let's start off with settings. So something within your overall coaching settings is availability. And this is where you can set up when clients are able to book calls with you. So be sure that you go through and add in the different times. You can see here, you can click on the different dates and times and pick when you want people to be able to set up a call with you. Now we'll get into if you allow people to book the times themselves or with group coaching programs, obviously you will set those times and I'll show you how to do that all here in a second. You can also pick the booking time window. So I recommend to do like six weeks or even maybe two months in advance if you're running longer coaching programs and then minimum notice scheduling. This is super important. Make this like for me, I need two hours at least. I schedule my days out. So you could either have two hour notice or I would even say like one day notice. It's totally up to you, but make sure you put this in. Then if you scroll down, you'll be able to connect a calendar. And so you can see here, you can add your Google Calendar, Microsoft Office or Calendly. For me, I pay for Calendly because that's how people set up strategy calls with me. So I have connected my Calendly here, but another great option I think would be Google Calendar. Honestly, whatever you use, you can't go wrong. Okay, once you've figured out those settings, hit save. Let's now set up your first coaching program. So you're going to hit programs. You'll see here I have three different programs. This is my actual one on the right. These other two are examples I'm going to take you through. But if we preview what a coaching program would look like, you'll see here, this is what it would look like for potential clients where they can click in to sessions and you can add details here, notes, resources, and then where clients will be able to schedule a session with you based on the time that you made available. Now, in order to set this up, you'll hit new coaching program and you'll put in your title, name, and description. Remember when you title anything, it needs to convey some sort of a transformation. It's always gonna sell better that way. Okay, I have my description name and then add a thumbnail image. If you don't have a thumbnail image, I recommend you make one with these dimensions in Canva or what you can do is just go to Pexels where you can get copyright free photos. And I picked out some photos here that I searched and then you can come in and upload them. This is just a fake coaching program that I'm making as if I were a dietitian. All right, hit continue. And then from here, you're gonna choose the program, one-on-one -on -one or group coaching. Let's start with one-on-one -on -one and let's say that it is six sessions. I'm going to hit then continue. And then you will pick your scheduling preference. Now, I highly recommend to just use Kajabi's scheduler. This is amazing because in the settings, we can have it so that your coaching calls record within Kajabi and then just upload right after. Instead of having to do a call outside of Kajabi in Zoom and then record it and then upload it for your clients, this saves so much time. If you've done any coaching sessions, you know what I'm talking about if you use Zoom. So I recommend to use just Kajabi's scheduler or if you wanted to do something like Calendly, you can, but I choose to use Kajabi scheduler. The location, then I'm going to pick Kajabi Live video as well. But if you wanted to use something like Zoom, you could. Then you will select the duration. I'm going to have my calls be 60 minutes and then hit continue. From here, you'll pick the colors you want your course to be. I recommend to not use these ones. I don't know, I think they're kind of meh. I think better to use your own. Once you've picked your colors, hit continue. Then you're going to price your coaching program. You can either have it be free or paid. I'm going to say this is a one-time payment of let's say $9.97. And then you will select your payment provider. I recommend to use Kajabi Payments. 
or you can use Stripe, whatever it is, and then save and finish. This is going to create an offer page for you already set up. You'll see here, it's then created that offer for you of 9.97. Next, you will go to package outline. And so you'll see, this is where you have those six sessions. Now you can click into each session and then add in a session description and Pro tip, if you want a really fast way of doing this, I recommend that you go into ChatGPT. So I'll ask ChatGPT to write that out or I can give it, and the more detail I can give it on what we're covering each session, the better. But because it's a fake course, I'm gonna use the power of AI as much as I can. So I can go ahead and I can copy this, add in a description, and then you can add in agenda. And I could add things for our call that day. And then I can also add any resources that my client may need. I'm just, let's just say I've added a PDF or something like that. I could go in and let's say I've got meal plan, save the resource. And then you'll see once I have this saved, I can go and I can actually preview what this will look like for a client. So you'll see here, I could click into session one and you'll see details. So I could click these off as we go through the call, how awesome is that? And then you can look and see notes. So these are shared notes that both you and your client are able to see. This is so cool. And then also your own notes. So it'd be your own notes as a coach or your client's own notes as well that only you or them can see. And then resources, you can see here, whatever resources you need, they show up there as well. Within this page as well, your client is able to hit schedule session and then book a call with you. So they could pick a time, hit confirm, and then it's going to send both you and them an email with information reminders of that call. Next, I want you to hit offers and you'll see here that the offer that we already set up when we initially built out the coaching program is right here and you can click into it and edit it however you would like and set up that page with all the information in the offers section. That's where it'll take you. And then you can even preview what it currently looks like here. Obviously we need to add in some things and edit this checkout page. Now, if you want an in-depth tutorial on how to create a sales page, then definitely check out this video where I go more in depth in creating a sales page and an offer page. I'm not gonna do that right now, we're just talking about coaching. But something good to note is if you go back to your offers, you can actually create a new offer and if you wanted to make some sort of like a payment plan, you could. And I could go in and I could do a payment plan and then I could have multi-pay set up for this as well. Next, if you go to settings, you'll see all the information we already put in, but I want you to scroll down and see where it says Kajabi live recording. I highly recommend that you automatically upload your Kajabi live recording to session. So I toggle this on and then hit save. Something really cool that you can also do within Kajabi coaching is create page upsells. So this says control whether or not an upsell button appears after your client completes the session. You can use the upsell to advertise any offer with a coaching program. So if I were to toggle this on, you could see that after a coaching session, maybe I wanted to offer another bonus call what they could pay for. I could create that offer. So let's see, let's just pick an offer, like let's say YouTube management, and then I could add text for them to click on to buy another call. I'm gonna to toggle that off for now and hit save. Once you've done this, you're really set to go for your one-on-one -on -one coaching program. Now let's talk about group coaching within Kajabi. Now, the only difference with one-on-one -on -one coaching and group coaching is that you can create groups if you toggle that it's for group coaching. So you'll see here, if we were to go and create a course, Let's say I'm doing a coaching program that's YouTube channel audits. When I get to this section, I just hit group coaching and then I can name the first group name and then I pick how many sessions. So let's say this four sessions, I can hit then continue. And then you'll see here all the same information that we already talked about. Hit the duration, click continue. Pick your colors, hit continue, price your offer. So once you have this all created, you'll see the big difference is that you now have this groups section where you are able to take groups through the same itinerary, but let's just say you do four group coaching cohorts a year. This makes it really easy so you don't have to recreate 
the coaching sessions every single time. So when you hit outline, you'll see this is where you can go in and you can add in all the information for each section. So if I click on session one, you'll see you can add the description, agenda, any uploads or information for people like you did before. And then when you go into the groups, this is where you can then set session times. So you'll see here, I already scheduled out some future sessions where if you click in here, if I go to session three, I could hit schedule session and then I would pick that time. So let's say it's gonna happen this time. I would hit confirm and then Kajabi will notify each participant within this group coaching program who has access to it, who bought it through the offer page. This just makes it super easy. And also then the session recording will save to this page. And so if you preview what it looks like for your clients, it just makes it super easy to do and beautiful. You've got your notes section again and resources. You can see here, this is where people can then join into the calls. And when you're ready to start a call, you can just hit start session. And that is going to open up the session for you and for your clients. If we go back to just the coaching program in general, you can hit new group. And then let's say this is the winter cohort. I can create another program and you'll see it'll set up the same information for me, the same program, but I will just schedule new times for this next cohort. So you'll see here two of my different coaching programs going through the same itinerary. And now that you understand how to set up an awesome coaching program for your clients, make sure that you check out how to build out a strong sales page in Kajabi. I break that down step by step for you. And that video even comes with a free PDF the breaking everything down to create a killer sales page to be able to then sell this awesome coaching program that you're building out. Don't forget to grab my extended 30 day Kajabi trial. And with that, you get immediate access to the zero to 10 K course roadmap. If this video is helpful for you, it's so helpful for me. If you can give it a thumbs up, be sure to subscribe. Let me know if you have any Kajabi questions and I'll see you next video. Bye.